Calculate the number of sides of a regular polygon whose interior angles are each 160 degrees. There are two methods to solve this problem. Method 1. Let n be the number of sides. We've got to find the number n. We know for any polygon, if we do n minus 1 times 180, that gives me the angle sum of the interior angles of a polygon. If I divide that by n, that gives me the size of one of them, in which in this case is 160, because each interior angle is 160. Now all I need to do is solve this equation. To solve it, first we multiply both sides by n, to remove this n from here. So on the left hand side we get 180 times n minus 2, and on this side we're going to get 160 times n. Next we need to expand the brackets. So expanding the brackets 180 times n gives me 180n. 180, 180 times minus 2 gives me minus 360. That's still equal to 160n. Notice we keep my equal signs in a straight line. Right, now we look at 160n and 180n to see which one is the smaller. And this one is the smaller, so the opposite thing now is to take minus 160n. So 180 take away 160n will give me 20n. And we've still got minus 360. And then 160n take away 160n gives me nothing on this side. To uh, next we need to add 360 to both sides. So this side we're just going to get 20n, and this side we're going to get 0 plus 360, which is 360. Finally, we need to divide both sides by 20, and that's going to give that n is equal to 18 sides. That's method 1. Method 2 is a little bit more simpler. Method 2, find the exterior angle and we know for any polygon that i plus e is equal to 180. So i is 160 plus e is equal to 180. Taking away 160, that's going to give that the exterior angle is 20 degrees. Now the sum for any polygon of the exterior angles is going to be equal to 360. So if each one of these is 20 and we divide 20 into 360, that should give me the number of sides of the polygon. So n will be 360 divided by 20, which gives me the answer again, 18 sides. So this, this method here is a little bit easier than perhaps this method.